Today is World Mental Health Day 2020, and I'll be sharing a really simple expressive arts exercise for anxiety. This is a great way to tune in to notice what we're feeling in our bodies and express ourselves artistically. Today is day 17 in our 30-day art challenge, and our prompt for today, perfectly fit, is pressure. To begin, bring to mind a recent situation where you felt pressure. Notice any sensations in your body. And if these sensations had a color or a shape, what would they look like? Allow yourself to make marks without judgment. And keeping in mind with mindful art activities, there's no right or wrong way that you can make your art here. I'll be sharing more prompts later in the video after we've created the image to incorporate movement and notice more sensations. And one thing I like to mention is that colors have different meanings to different people. So just allowing yourself to create, giving yourself that permission to choose any colors or make marks that you'd like in this moment without needing to understand it or quote unquote, do it right. If you're just now joining us for the 30 day art challenge, there is a calendar down below in the description box you can download for free. Definitely check that out so you can join us for future mindful art activities. Taking a moment to notice your thoughts as you create here or any sensations. And largely this practice is about slowing down. It's about noticing what's coming for us, coming up for us in the moment. So you might notice as you're making here, judgments that arise. So just noticing that and returning back to the marks you're making and just giving yourself this gift of self-care. You're just giving yourself space to be with what's here and to express yourself. You may want to explore this mindful art activity with painting or drawing. You might wanna work abstractly or literally. Again, there's no right or wrong way and everyone's art will look and feel different. So if you want more inspiration around different ways you can make mindful art, you can always check out our other videos here on the channel and subscribe. We do also have online e-courses with more techniques and prompts. But for today, you may notice a slowing down as you create. Noticing your marks and your breath. Noticing how you feel in this moment. And if you're new to expressive arts exercises or mindful art activities, I want to share just briefly a little bit about mindful art. Mindful art combines meditation with art activities. And the practice mainly focuses on creating without judgment. A lot of what we share here on our Mindful Creative Muse YouTube channel are five-minute mindful art activities. So you can do these practices with very little time, with minimalist art supplies. They're simple and quick practices that are really designed um, as a gateway to meditate and make art that prompt you to notice your thoughts, prompts you to notice any sensations that you have in your body. It prompts you to notice senses. So being present with what you see, with what you hear, with what you touch on the page here, with any sort of taste, et cetera. So all of your senses, even hearing as you make marks on the page. Many people and my students say that they experience Again, this slowing down as well as being in a flow state. And both of those things, if you struggle with anxiety or depression or stress, all of that helps us to return to the present moment and feel more calm. So if we're in that flow state or if we're in a relaxed slowing down state, that's a natural process. So again, mindful art activities focuses on the process, not the final product. And largely, the intention behind that is to give ourselves permission to create and make without judgment. We're not trying to get it right. We're not trying to please anyone else. We're just simply being curious. 
So I want to share some optional practices if you want to deepen this meditative art activity. So simply taking a moment here to take three breaths and notice sensations as it relates to that prompt pressure. We're going to explore some movement here. So making various gestures or hand movements. I'm doing it seated here with hand movements. So for me, this is how pressure feels in my body right now. Giving yourself permission to feel and express yourself however you'd like. And I know if you're new to this, it might be a little bit strange just to giving yourself permission if you're by yourself for you to have privacy. And then noticing any opposites, opposite sensations for me that arise as spaciousness and peace. And I felt that directly within my heart area where my hand was resting. So you wanna take three breaths with this new opposite sensation. Noticing how that feels in your body, making a mental note to give yourself space to feel that, and then making new gestures for this opposite sensation. So for me, it's spaciousness and peace, and that manifested as this extending outward. Instead of this gripping, tight, twisting, inward pressure, it's this releasing, expansive openness outward. So noticing those sensations and then returning back to your art if you'd like, you can add any marks that represent that new sensation. Marks or colors, shapes, etc. So I had added just a little bit of blue and you can always journal afterwards as well to notice what arose for you, any insights or ahas. Whether you struggle with anxiety, depression, or just feeling stressed on occasion, I hope you find this mindful art activity interesting and inspiring to help you tune into what you're feeling and have some sort of outlet for yourself personally that you can create. If you find you need additional support, I will have some links in the description box below. If you'd like to continue exploring simple mindful art activities, you can watch one of these videos here, or I will see you for tomorrow's next day in our 30-day art challenge.